baby for Christmas, Kodak reviewed for me. Four Angry Birds. Okay, I know it's three Angry Birds and one pig, but give me a break, the kid only gave me three birds. Angry Birds. If some of you guys somehow don't know what Angry Birds is by now, Angry Birds is an app for the smartphone, such as an iPhone or an Android, that involves using a slingshot to launch little birds at structures inhabited by pigs in an effort to destroy them. It's uh, become surprisingly popular, and it's one of the most popular apps ever created. So as a result, it has ventured into the toy business. You can find keychains, plushes, pull chains, all kinds of things. However, one of the most intriguing ones is this game called Angry Birds Knock on Wood. Now you can play Angry Birds in real life. Build, launch, destroy, all things we love to do on this channel. Anyway, it is a technically a real-life version of Angry Birds. You build the structures out of the bricks and uh, take the slingshot, take a bird, and it's kind of a fun game, but you have to wonder, who would spend $15 on a real-life version of an app they can download for free? <laughs> popular enough to keep our store in short supply because of how you're able to recreate the game without risking ruining mommy's iPhone. The rules for Angry Birds Knock on Wood are as follows. What you do is you pick a point card, you draw the card, and you build the structure that is depicted on the card. Now, in order to actually score points, you get a small list of birds that you get to use, and then you actually fire it head on rather than to the side like you see in the games. Now, this might seem like a bit of an easy game, but the birds are made out of this sort of squishy material, which makes the use of these uh, launching birds surprisingly ineffectual against the structures. Although, depending on the bird you use, they have different levels of functionality, and the bomb bird pretty much instant death to whatever it hits. It also uses a variety of interesting point systems, for example, the little stars, the little eggs that you can collect if you knock them over to earn some bonus points. First person to 1,000 points wins. I'm sure at some point we'll get a remake of the Alfred Hitchcock movie only called Angry Birds. Maybe with a few birds that explode, or a few birds that split into three birds as they attack our main characters. The sheer veracity of this series kind of shows the potential of the internet marketing nowadays, because Annoying Orange, which just started as an internet video, now has toys based on it that are sold at Toys R Us, kind of like the ones for Angry Birds. So. You know, the sky's the limit. You can never really be sure what catches on, but you know, once they catch on, people are pretty quick to invest on it, and Angry Birds is kind of an example of that. Anyway, tomorrow I'll be back with a whole new toy as we continue Kodok's 12 Toys of Christmas. Happy Holidays!